Well, there are currently uh, over 6 million people forcibly displaced by conflict and uh, violence in the ECOWAS sub-region. Well, it is for this uh, reason that the ECOWAS and the UN Refugee Agency has signed a memorandum of understanding to strengthen collaboration in protecting refugees, uh, stateless and internally displaced persons in the region. The ECOWAS president says that it will continue to work assiduously to tackle the root causes of conflicts in the region through diplomatic and political engagements. Countries that have suffered the most in the region include Burkina Faso, Niger, Nigeria, and uh, all the other countries, I must say. For us in ECOWAS, humanitarian access is important because when you talk about displaced people, you certainly need to take into account the need to access them and to support them. This is why ECOWAS instruments provide clearly that no sanction should affect humanitarian access. I'm also very happy to see that uh, with regard to the ratification and domestication of the 2009 African Union Convention for the protection and assistance of internally displaced persons in Africa, we can also count on the Commission and the work that uh, we can do with regard to the IDPs. And then, of course, the eradication of statelessness I might maybe uh, remind uh, some of us here saying that this is a work that has been going on for so, some years now. And then, of course, emergency management, given the level and the number of, of crises that we have in this region, it's very important that uh, we uh, join efforts and see exactly how we can uh, work much better.